So the carcass number just increases daily. I'm going to sweep these all out tomorrow. Actually, I'm going to vacuum them up. Whoa, what is that I see? Is my horse and your and Gabby's horse nuzzling each other? No. They're together though. My horse does not like boys. Wait, are they butt to head? I think they're butt to head. Oh no, they're head to head. Oh no, they were not butt to head, but they were close. So we are headed out because Sophie, I'm like, oh, this gets me excited. I seriously like was lazy all day. It was Sunday, and I was I just was lazy. lazy day, yeah. But anyway, you guys know Sophie's going through the whole transformation into being a teenager, and she was like, "Oh, mom, I really want to get this." And then she told me, and I'm like, "Okay, well, let's look it up online and see if we can find a secondhand one." It's always better to reuse. So I've ended up finding what she wanted online and we're literally five minutes later, we're headed there to pick it up. So we'll show you in just a few minutes when we get there, uh, what she's getting and she's excited and then we'll show you it again tomorrow when she has it all put together. Okay, so what she ended up getting was a little vanity with a mirror and it's pink and it has a little stool it's I don't like the power cord. anyways we ended up finding this she wants this because she wants to be able to do her makeup in her room and not have to compete with Gabby for the bathroom and I want a curling iron now and so I, I am all for that you guys every my birthday I want a curling iron yeah Good morning guys, welcome to today's video Sophie and I are headed out because Gracie is having a nap in the field do you have treats? Chino's waking her up. Oh, Chino, don't wake her up. All right, she's up and she's mad. He, we walked outside just in time for her to stand up, shake herself off, and kick him <laughs> and squeal. Sophie and I are headed outside again. So Gabby and Sam are gone doing new truck business. And Sophie and I can't find the horses. Do you ever do that thing where you like panic and, and you I work? I a horse calling. So like, <laughs> Sophie. We were trying to do some more baking and literally we kept looking for the horses and we couldn't find them. Like we can't see them because there's a hill in our yard. Gracie, and, Willow, Penny! And we still worry, like, you're all, always worried about horses. So anyways, we're like, oh, I'm sure they're fine. I'm sure they're fine. And then Sophie says, oh, I just heard a horse whinny. So then we put on our shoes and we come out awesome and we are finding them. <laughs> Find the horses, Molly. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't care. She's just like, Wee! It's possible they just went in the arena. Bye. What bothers me is that I did have a dream about something bad happening. Not bad, but oh my god, they're gone. No, I think they're Oh. Still can't see them. Oh. I think I see butt. Alright. You guys see? I see Gracie. But. Can't even see. It's so bright out here. I can't see. Oh, Where's Penny? You know we see we see three. You but, see that really yeah. long black thing? You know what's weird though? I always feel like no matter what happens, Penny would never leave. I feel it. Like I feel it in my bones. Even though like if a horse is all, all running away, she's gonna run probably. But I feel like I don't see Penny. I feel like she wouldn't run away. I feel like she would. I feel like she would never I run like away. She would. <laughs> I feel like she did. I feel like she's just in that tall grass hiding. She better not be. Better not be yeah, anymore. so we're getting our exercise for today. Actually, we're getting ready to go to horseback riding soon. I'm not gonna have Angie. Oh, there she is. Oh, <laughs> can you see her? Tell me, can you spot the penny? She's always on her own. Hi. Who are you calling to? She's like, you're not taking me in yet. Molly, don't go near her. Hi, Pen. Hi. Hello. What are you doing? Yeah. Hi. Hi. Stop calling my other horses. <laughs> Stop giving us a heart attack. Yeah. And then the other three. But it is funny how like they're in the shade, so you can barely see. Yeah, them. they're in the shade, which is freezing out here. Probably the grass. Thing. Well, 
We came, right we came for a walk. No. Even walk Gracie's back. getting chubby. She's never chubby. Do you guys notice how like even with oh, horses, tied, so every tied. body shape is so different? Like some horses gain weight in their bellies only and then have like skinny hips. Like that's Gracie. And then some horses get like, well like quarter horses get a big massive butt. Like Chino gets a big butt. Chino's only one part quarter horse. Yeah. But then, yeah, he's more Durable. thoroughbred. Anyways, just like it's funny how they all grow different. And then Willow gets a belly. <laughs> and then Chance, he was like, he'd get like a bigger belly, but he'd he be so skinny weight. everywhere else. Yeah. Like if I was skinny, my he face. as much as these mares, he doesn't gain weight. He's more than them, but it's because he's young. But anyways, if I was skinny, like the weight that I should be, my face would be so skinny, you guys. I gain all my weight in my hips. I found the horses. Hips in my thighs. Where do you grow? Where do you get yours? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Same with me. <laughs> Thank genetics, sister. So this is what Sophie and I made today. We made butter tarts. I made it. We both made it. <laughs> and these ones have walnuts and these ones have raisins. And we made a ton of them. And they freeze really good you for... Oh yeah, we made plain ones. They freeze really well for holidays. So we're gonna put those in the freezer. That was our goal for today to make those. That this looks is... really red on camera. Yeah, but they're like a purpley pink they're in real pink. life. Yeah, so anyways, this is like day what, three or four of Sophie getting up early and doing her hair and her makeup. Well, day one of getting up early because the other days were a weekend. Yeah. So I didn't have to be downstairs on time for school. Day three of makeup and hair. I quit curling my hair. <laughs> And she quits. Tomorrow, she'll just have regular straight hair. Actually, her hair is curly. But anyways, I wanted to show you guys something. You guys saw about an hour and a half ago, we went outside to check on the horses. So in the morning, they go out and they go far and they go out there and they go and they eat. But they know their schedule and they know that it's almost time to come in. And they know like when they're done eating. Um, by noon, every single day, when we go out, they've changed where they are. Let me show you. So... As you can see, they've all moved back closer to the gate, to the barn. Oh look, Penny's going in. Like, Penny does not like to be told what to do. She I saw us go. and she's like, okay, I'm going. I Willow's already go. going. Willow's going too, you guys. The, the footsteps pounding towards me. And I'm like, I'm... But look, our horses put themselves away. Except for the rebels. The rebels never do. Uh oh. Oh no! Come on, Gracie. Come on. You can do it. If we get all the girls in, Chino just comes. You just have to be careful. <laughs> Come on. Get in there. Get in. Get in. This is the first time I've ever shooed them in. Hi, Ben. I love you. I love that you come to me. She doesn't like to be told. <laughs> And there's Gracie. There we go. So Gabby always puts Chino in his stall and enables him to like eat hay all day because he's bigger and he needs more. I always just keep thinking to myself, like imagine if he just could stay out here with the girls and hang out. And Gabby doesn't like him too. And Sam doesn't like him too because he's always worried. Like what if they get fighting? And it's a smaller space. But when the Gabby and the Sam are away, the Laura will make her own decision. <laughs> so uh, we're just in the kitchen baking. So I'm going to just try it and see how they do. I think the one that will hate it the most is Penny if he tries to bother her. Because when she comes in, she always has a nap. <laughs> Hello, little Minnie. There she is. That's her nap spot. Okay, I wanted to tell you guys something really exciting though. So you guys know how Sophie has been training Willow to, to do tricks and stuff. Even if you try to stand by and hug her. Last night I was almost going to bed and I came across something on TikTok. And I was like, and it was for dogs. And I was like, oh, 
that would work for Willow. That would totally work for Willow. So then I sent the link for it to Sam, who was downstairs, and I said, oh my gosh, we need this. And he said, yeah, that's cool. And then I woke up this morning and he sent me the link saying it was gonna be delivered today from Amazon. <laughs> I was like, yes! So it is on its way, he ordered it. Well, I was, I guess, sleeping. So hopefully it will come today and we'll be able to show you guys what Sophie's gonna be doing next with Willow. It, oh my gosh, this is gonna change. This is gonna change how she works with Willow. I don't know, it's gonna be fun. Let's go spy on the two lovebirds. I honestly never thought that Pent, that what Gracie would ever have a friend, but just goes to show you guys, there's a friend out there for everyone. Oh. They're so cute. Hold on when you need a friend, I'll never let you go again. Reach out when your mind's uneasy, cause I'll understand. today has a lot of farrier left behind. Sophie and I are missing her having a horse so much like Gabby's so independent does her own thing has her own routine with her own horse and I always am like with Sophie and I feel like I get to love Sophie's horse as much as she loves her horse and I'm missing that. I appreciate so many people are still sending us ads though oh, that makes it so much easier we've been looking and looking and looking and it's just so hard because the reason that we decided to lease Chance and take a chance on him was because I want her to, we want her to have the right horse, a horse that, that fits her so that she doesn't have to say goodbye again because saying goodbye to a horse that you love and that you've like built a relationship with over years is so difficult. So anyway, we're still looking and I have a few surprise things, hopefully, happening for Sophie's birthday. So, well, you never know. We're gonna see what's gonna happen. Like, one thing I learned, you can't rush God's timing and you can't rush God's plan. You just are, we're just all pawns in this whole big scheme for the greater good. There's a lineup for the bathroom. I'm standing here watching. Gabby was in there. I have to pee, now Sam is in there. You have to pee? His name is Ricky. Oh, the little thing is named yeah. Ricky? Yeah, there's a new horse here. Look, Gabby, your horse is standing right there waiting. She's like, oh, there's my girl. What? Are you riding with us today? No. All right, and here comes horse number two. <laughs> oh, she just called out to you. I see Brandon out there dragging the arena, so we're going to be the first ones to ride. That's, that's not and Brandon. Oh, it's not it's Brandon? Right oh. Anyway, Sam has some news to tell you. Juice, tell you that the truck that I thought I bought, <laughs> I didn't buy because it wasn't ready in time and nothing was done. But I bought a new truck today. I went to Toronto with Gabby and we ended up trying a truck and we bought it. So we're gonna be getting a new truck soon. What color is it? It's blue. But it looks black. It's dark blue. Anyway, he got a good truck perfect truck. Wow. There's a horse galloping in the field. <laughs> also, I have a problem with Sophie's little horse, Willow. Every time, like this morning when I took them out in the barn, I would walk and she would follow me and she would turn around. <laughs> now 
always thought she was going to kick me, but she would turn around and look at me, keep following me, and then turn around. I, every time she turned around, I thought she was going to kick me. Clearly. Clearly, obviously. Twirling. Bad trick. Yeah, is what she prefers. Bad trick. Everybody thinks she's turning around to kick. Don't you know that you're beautiful?